one of my Making It Work series. Today is Tuesday. I had yesterday off because car issues. So um, let's get started. I have to find a ride to work yet, and I'm running out of time. Okay, the first thing I use, I'm going to use this week is the NYX um, Brow Mascara in Brunette. And I got to tell you, so far, I love this. The color is perfect, in my opinion. If all of my colors were like this, I'd be a happy camper. So, <clears throat> then I use the Ulta Eye Primer, as usual. I'm going to use the Ulta Voluptuous Volume Mascara by by Ulta <laughs> and um, so far I really like this it's a little wet but it does not clump so I like that for my blush this week I am using Laura Geller Bake Blush and Brighten and Tropic Hues and it's just a little bitty one but I think it's very pretty Okay, for my lipstick today, I am using the Color Icon Metallic Lipstick. Same one I used in my Get Ready With Me. Um, it is Peony Express, and I absolutely love it. I just think it's the prettiest pink. Um, you have to be careful because it likes to gather right at the edges. So I, I had to do a lot of dabbing, but I really, really like it. The color is beautiful. And this week, for my eyeshadow palette, I am using BH Cosmetics Carly Bible Palette. And this was the first time I'd ever used it. So this is what I used for my base, and I will probably use that all week long. This here I used for my, my um, transition color. You know, it's pretty light. I had to go in a couple of times to darken it up. Um... I used this for my eyeshadow and this for my eyeshadow. And this here is a lot lighter than I thought it would be. A lot. So you can see, very pretty. Very pretty colors. And I like that. I, I really like this touch on the edge. And then today for my highlighter, I used this color. And it is a beautiful highlighter. I don't know if you can see that or not that little bit of a glow there it's beautiful um, these are not horribly powder powdery but like I said the lighter colors you really have to work at um, but I like it so I really have to get going guys I will talk to you tomorrow in day hey everybody, two and Bye. welcome to Wednesday's edition of making it work this is my day two and Let's see what I've got on my eyes today. This week I am using the BH Cosmetics Carly Bible Palette. Beautiful palette. Okay, the first thing I did was use this as my base. I decided to go a little bit darker today, so since I'm wearing purple, I wore this as my transition and crease color, and this as my eyelid color. And I used this one, whoops, this one as my highlighter today. Beautiful. Show you my eyes. I really like the way it turned out. That darker, a little bit darker transition and then the, the lighter on the lid. I really kind of like that. You know, it's still not real dark, you know, but I, I like the way it turned out. Okay, then for my lips today, I used Bite Beauty in Cafe. And this is what it looks like. Just a little itty bitty pointed tip that I kind of used as a lip liner. I got it in my Bite Beauty um, Christmas tin. And I have one more that I will be using the end of the week. This one here is a, a very light pinky nude. It's pretty. It's pretty. It is not too light. Um... I wouldn't want it any lighter, but it's not too light. So anyway, thank you for joining me today, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Good -bye. morning, and welcome back to day three. <laughs> I get confused because this was a little bit of a shorter week for me. Uh, it is day three of my making it work, and 
I'm glad you joined me. <laughs> Let's get started. I'm using my Carly Bible um, BH Cosmetics palette this week. Today I use, this as my base, I use the lighter shade as my um, transition crease color today. And then I use this darker brown, brownish bronze color for my lids. And oh my god, I love it. It is so pretty. It is such a bronzy brown color. Oh my, it's pretty. And then I used this as my highlighter today. So pretty. I'm really happy with my look today. Then today I used the Maybelline Color Jolt. This is the first time I've had this on my lips. It's an intense lip paint. Uh, 05 stripped down is the color. It compares to Too Faced Melteds. It's got the same kind of applicator, the kind of sponge there with the colors. And it is gorgeous. I love it. I am really happy with it. It feels um, a, a bit thicker. Um, we will see how it lasts today. Usually nothing lasts I haven't had anything that's lasted through my lunch, and I really don't look at myself a lot during the day. Um, you know, I work in a, a darkened bar, so I don't really, you know, I look at my hair once in a while to make sure it's not crazy, but um, other than that, I really don't look at myself a whole lot. So, um, but this, I am in love with this color. I recommend this highly if you like um pinky nudes, um, pinky mauve nude colors. This is beautiful. I don't know that I'll get any of the other ones because I, I'm hoping that they expand their range because this is really the only one I was interested in. So we will see how this compares. What I should have done was wore one of the, maybe I'll do that. Maybe I will wear my, um, other one Here's tomorrow. regular peony. So maybe I should wear the regular peony tomorrow. I'll do that. The melteds wouldn't be a true, true match. So anyway, so far, super happy with this. I, it was easy to apply. Very easy to apply. It just feels a little bit thicker and there's a little taste to it, but it's got kind of a really really faint candy taste so it's not unpleasant at all so anyway i'll talk to you tomorrow and happy Bye -bye. friday everybody and i hope you are enjoying the beginning of your weekend and let's get started with my eye makeup today uh first thing i used was my carly bible um bh cosmetics palette and today I used this for my base as usual. I used a combination of these two. I used this in my crease and this one above my crease today. I don't know. I just felt adventurous today. I don't know that you'll even be able to tell. Um, and then I used this on my lid, but then I used um, this one here. Wait a minute. No. No, I take that back. I used this one on my lid, and then I used this one, this this highlight, just uh, like the tip of my brush and went along kind of like an eyeliner, only it's a little thicker. I don't even know if you're going to be able to tell. This here mostly covered up. Um, wait a minute, where am I? This one here almost mainly covered up this color which this color is absolutely beautiful. All right, and then I used um, this color here for my highlight today. And my highlight, I had to dab a bit because it was ba-boom in your face. Okay, here is my eye look. I don't even know if you're going to be able to tell any difference. But I just, I think it's gorgeous. All right. And then today, yesterday, you remember I used the Jolt, the color Jolt in uh, Strip 
bare, I think it's called. Stripped down. And I loved it. It um, lasted until I ate about 2 o'clock in the afternoon, so it lasted pretty darn well. Through um, drinking, um, I drank out of a can. It didn't have any transfer on the can at all that I could see. Um, but it did disappear once I ate. I had uh, chicken strips for lunch, and it, it disappeared. So, but I thought... I saw a video last night where they said it was a really thin consistency. I didn't find that. I thought it was a little thicker consistency, and it tasted a little bit of a very slight taste of like a fruity taste, where she said it didn't taste at all, but she could smell the fruity. Um, so we were pretty conflicting, but, you know, I go by what I feel. So anyway... So today I used Too Faced Melted. I gotta tell you, I like the Jolt much better. I have, uh, I think, three or four of these Melteds, and I do like them, but it is a thinner con consistency, and it comes out of the, the tube very fast. I had way too much lipstick. And it gathered in the on the edges of my lips so I had to work quite a bit to get it to look you know decent and this is a very pretty color this is just peony it's not the the melted or the uh, matte or metallic it's just the regular peony I thought that I better use that since I used a regular color in the jolt and it is a very pretty color but um, I much prefer prefer the jolt over this and I'm really hoping that they come out with more colors. They don't have very many colors. I think like six maybe. And um, yeah, I'm really hoping they come out with some different ones because this color I'm loving. I'm also giving one of these away in my giveaway that I'm putting up here pretty soon. So anyway, today is melted. And I will talk to you tomorrow, my last day in my making it work. Good morning, everybody, Bye -bye. and welcome to Saturday's edition of Making It Work, and it's the last day of my work week, so I have tomorrow off. So let's get started. There's quite a bit to do, and of course, I'm running a little behind as usual. <laughs> I don't know why I do that. I don't know. I should just set my alarm for 15 minutes earlier than I already do. All right, first thing I used this week was the NYX uh, Tinted Brow Mascara in Brunette. I love this stuff. This will be a definite, definite repurchase for me. This is the perfect color. If all of my stuff was this shade, I would be a happy camper. I love this stuff. Next was my Ulta Eye Primer. You guys know I love this, and it seems like it's never going to end. <laughs> As soon as I get on the, on camera, here goes my nose. Ulta Voluptuous Volume Mascara in Jet Black. And I love this stuff, too. It works so nice. The Ulta in Jet Black. I will definitely repurchase this. Um, Ulta has really got some pretty good stuff. I love their brow mascara. I love this For my mascara. Blush this week I used Laura Geller uh, Baked Bra Blush and Brighten in Tropic Hues. And this is okay. It's not my favorite, but it is, you know, it, it shows pretty well. You know, I like stuff that'll actually show up on my skin. So, um, let's see here. We're, let's go with the eye palette. And I used the Carly Bible palette by BH Cosmetics. I love, frickin' love this palette. It is so pigmented and so beautiful. Today I used this for my base, this for my crease, and I used this. You know, these here are supposed to be for um, your face. For, supposed to be like highlighters they're too dark so this one here I used for my eyes today and it's beautiful just beautiful 
but it this every single color in here I haven't had trouble with anything this is so pigmented this color here you have to tap your brush in at once and it covers your whole eye beautiful um, just very pigmented, very buttery. You know, you don't want to press too hard on this stuff because it's good eyeshadows. For $14.99, this is a steal. I highly recommend. And also, I used this today as my um, highlighter. And their highlighters rock also. I mean, they are so... I mean, can you see that? Look at that. I mean, you can definitely see it on my face. I love it. Okay, for lipsticks this week. Today, I used Bite Beauty, and it's um, Torch. Tort. And it's beautiful. They are like that. I got this in my Christmas tin from last year. Holiday tin, I should say. So this today I use or this week I used two of those. I used my melted and my lipstick jolt from or my color jolt from Maybelline. And to tell you the honest truth, I like this one better than this one. This one here was more watery. This one was thicker. They they stayed on about the same amount of time. Um, but this one here felt creamier on my lips. I really, you know, this one here is uh, $15 more than this one. And I, I like the, I recommend these. I really do like them. And then the last thing, or the, I think it was, I don't remember when I wore it, but the Metallic Liquid Lipstick by um, Wet n Wild that I got from Leah. And this is Peony Express. And it's very pretty. I like this one actually better than I do the other one. The, the other one's a little bit corally. And if anybody knows, I'm not crazy about orange. But I still will wear it. But I do. This one here is my favorite. So anyway, that is my lipsticks, my makeup, everything for the week. I hope you liked it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. And please share this video. It helps so much in getting the word out for everybody. I share. If I watch a video, it's shared. So, um, please do that, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.